So I've been hearing that some of you have been struggling with your order of operations. So maybe this example will finally get you to pay attention. Here we have 4 divided by 1 times in parentheses 6 plus 7. So to solve this problem, let me write down PEMDAS. So P E M D A S. So the P comes first, which means things in parentheses are going to be done first. So in parentheses, we have 6 plus 7, so that happens first. 6 plus 7 is just 13. And then, so we're done with that. Next is exponents, but I don't see any exponents anywhere, so we're done with that. Next is multiplication and division. Now be careful, PEMDAS implies that multiplication happens before division because we write it as M first and then D. However, what you really need to understand is that with PEMDAS, multiplication and division can actually happen in either order. So I'm going to write it like this, M and D. So how do we know which one comes first, multiplication or division? Well, the rule is you go from left to right, and whatever is on the left happens first. And then what happens on the right happens next, when you have multiplication and division at the same time. So here we have 4 divided by 1, and then when you see 1 parentheses 13, that's actually 1 times 13. So now, because we're going from left to right, this division is left, so it happens first. So we do 4 divided by 1 first. We don't do 1 times 13 first. So that's what we're going to do. Let's do 4 divided by 1. Well, 4 divided by 1, that's just 4. So I'm going to say do this first, and that's 4. And then carry over the times 13. And then now we just do 4 times 13. And if you do 4 times 13, that's just 52. And just like that, we're done. And then there's, a more addish, there's no addition, there's no subtraction, and we're done with all the operations. So just like that, we're done. So the answer to this problem is 52. I hope that clears things up a little bit.